All right, guys, I figured I'd do another video. Um, I looked at my video, my last video of um, the new Maljin kit for the Zero Turn, and it was really shaky, and um, it didn't really give a good example of how fine this cuts it up or what it looks like after the fact. So I have a good bit of leaves on the ground. <clears throat> right there and I am going to go ahead and mow them I've used this mulching attachment um, or mulching kit a few times now and what I've discovered is that you have to go in a counterclockwise circle to make the leaves spread out properly if you go up and up and back and up and back it leaves a line um, in the middle of where you're cutting so if I go down this way and come back right in between the two it'll leave a line of the leaves so what I have been doing is going around the trees and then cutting the rest of the yard how I normally do um, but it, it does work good and I will give you a uh, steadier um, a steadier shot of what it actually looks like after I'm done but I wanted to you know I have a good bit of leaves on the ground. It's pretty dry, so I'm going to go ahead and do this, and then I will um, give you a better close-up. Um, the reason I'm making this video is because when before I bought that kit, I looked around, and there's only one other one other video I found, and it was a real quick video, and it didn't really show how well uh, it worked or or how well it didn't. So I was, I was pretty apprehensive about buying it, but I did, and uh, I'm glad I did at this point. But this will give you a better understanding whether it's worth the $100, um, 80, 90 bucks uh, for you to spend, whether it'll work for you or, you know, getting a bagging, a bagger would be a better idea. Um, so I'm going to go cut, I'm going to cut this and then I will, I'll stop and you could see what it looks like um, after the fact. Like I said, there's a good bit of leaves. All right, so this... Um, is what is left whenever I go around in a circle little chunks you could see I mean it cleaned up really well there are some spots with a little bit more um, I wasn't in a super rush but I wasn't going real slow either um, and it does a pretty good job now uh, for an example for this video, I went uh, up around this way, up around this way, and then came back down the same way, just to show you how it kind of bunches up whatever it's chopping into um, into a pile, which I don't I don't want I want them to be spread out, um, so that's why. I am going around in a circle versus um, up and back because it leaves a little pile basically where um, the two paths come together and this is all on the path that came together I mean it's pretty fine shreds the leaves are dry though so that helps them um, mulch up but it basically blows some of the shrapnel out right here which the air has to have somewhere to go so um you know it doesn't surprise me but when you go around in a circle it keeps pushing it out and out and out and it chops it up finer and finer as you go around so um it works better if you go around in a circle but um it will work if you want to go out and back or if you just cut your your yard in a circle it'll just keep blowing um, like the scraps out towards where where it would normally be discharged but they're cut up a lot finer than they would normally be so um, this is probably gonna be a pretty short video but I just wanted to put this out there I know because I had questions about it before I bought it so hopefully it helps you um, please comment like and subscribe thanks for watching